what's up everybody? I am here on my floor for another organization video slash unboxing with Chuckies again. Before I jump into this video, I want to give a special shout out to my Muddy Cold patrons. Thank you so, so much for your support. If you want to become a Muddy Cold patron, you can click the link down in the description below. I offer early access, exclusive videos, and special rights of things that you can request for me to review or talk about or even stream on Discord, among other little perks. And if you haven't done so already, hit that subscribe button below. I know more than half of you are not subscribed. I don't know what you're doing. I put extra videos on this channel every now and then, and you'll never know when that happens unless you subscribe. Today's video is brought to you by Chaotic Harmony. Uh, I'm not sponsored or anything, but this is a video I've been looking forward to doing. And I've already done like a checky organization video. If you haven't checked that out, uh, I'll put a card. I think it's on this side. <laughs> uh, if not, it's on this side. But I think it's on this side. Um, you can check that out. Um, I was putting all of my checkies in this binder right here. This was my checky binder, and now it has become my uh, like autograph slash business card binder so I have like pictures from celebrities from conventions and then I have like cosplay uh, photos that I've gotten so there you go uh, yeah and I also put all of my business cards that I get from conventions and stuff so that's all in here and then I have some other little postcards and pictures that I've gotten from conventions too. So now that is in this binder. So what happened to the checkies? Well, uh, one of my patrons and friend, uh, one of my patrons gifted me a binder, a bigger, thicker binder to put all my checkies because they were getting out of hand. So I participated in a limited project that Chaotic Harmony was doing during the pandemic. Well, I mean, technically we're still in a pandemic, but they were doing this last year in 2020 uh, to give back to bands and uh, idol groups, alt idol groups in Japan, and also support um, venues and stuff during this pandemic because a lot of musicians and artists have not been able to um, do any performances and stuff because of COVID. So they put together this beautiful, awesome, like, checky project, and I definitely was all on top of it. I wanted to definitely support my groups and support them as well. So I bought a bunch of che checkies from them. Um, if you haven't heard of Chaotic Harmony before, or you haven't seen previous videos I've done about them. They are a company that bring Japanese talents to America, whether it is fashion, music, all of the above. Um, and they've been trying to get back into activities as of this year safely. Um, I'm looking forward to seeing the owners of this lovely company, Melissa and Haley, again in person because they are lovely per people and I enjoy working with them. Um, I've done some exclusive content that I have yet to post here, but I will in the near future along with some giveaways. But as I said, this video is not sponsored by them, uh, but I do want to give them a little shout out support. Um, currently, as I am filming this, they are working on another huge project to help support groups and stuff and give back, uh, which is a special omnibus uh, compilation album that they are doing with uh, some of the artists that they have worked with in the past, such as Sick2 or Six Squared, I never know how to say their name, uh, Zon, Initial L, etc etc you can totally check that out i'll put a link in the description below definitely check that out and i'm looking forward to seeing the finished product 
So for now, I am going to be organizing these lovely checky that I bought. I bought way too much. Um, I also want to like give like a short little thank you once again to Melissa for helping me organize these. I bought, like I said, I bought a lot of checky, and when I wasn't feeling so well, I realized that they kind of weren't like together. I think they were somewhat, but I wanted to put together all the groups and together because I bought multiple groups. So there were some that I couldn't like figure out, but once we got it all strained out and had a little talk, uh, I got them all strained out and I just want to thank her once again. Thank you so much, Melissa. So this is what I did. I like stripped some post-it notes and made little notes of what band is each band. So you'll see that while I'm organizing here on the floor. There is a lot. There's like, there's this stack and then there's like a whole nother envelope here with another stack of checkies so I got plenty to organize I think there's also some already in the binder that I need to like put in order as well um, if you're curious what bands that I'll be uh, organizing uh, I'm gonna read my little invoice and I will be mentioning in the as I organize as well so I have some from Shaja, which are signed, uh, Diora, Doubt, Dog in the Peril World Orchestra, Razor, Lead Speak Monsters, Dada Roma, Dada Roma Razor, Kizu, Initial L, Ice, and uh, Arlie Quinn, and Mary. So some of them are completely random. Some of them I could pick who I wanted or I can just get a whole set of the whole group. Uh, some of them are uh, autographed and some are not. So it's a good um, mixture of things. So uh, there are also other artists part of the group. Uh, maybe I'll put like a list of what other groups participated in it because um, a lot of the alt idol groups, um, I am into some uh, alt idol groups, but these particular that are working with Chaotic Harmony, I haven't listened to yet, but I will in the future. So I'm looking forward to that. And, but yeah, I didn't buy any alt idol groups. Uh, most all of these are Visual K artists. So uh, if you're curious, what's like kind of going on here? Um, as you can see, a little Violet K-pop bag here and you know all my packages that I still have to make videos for so just ignore that for now anyway so you're gonna see the floor view of me putting these checkies away just like the first video um, the only difference is uh, similar to my organizing and unboxing my anime figures um, I won't be really talking too much um, I'll just be straight up organizing uh, the stuff on the floor and I'll slow down the footage and stuff and kind of like show each group off properly before I place them in the binder and you get to listen to some cool music and I hope that it doesn't get you know copyright claimed and, and blocked <laughs> uh, if it does I'll change the music but I want to like showcase some of these bands music if possible um, Hopefully this is a fun, introspective kind of organizing tool and just, you know, nice to like show off stuff. Yeah, that's that's pretty much it for the intro. I'm going to change the angle. Hopefully it's a good one, but uh, definitely check out my first checky organizing video um, and that'll really explain the process of how I put stuff in my binder. I might repeat like a little bit of what I do. But it's nothing super complicated, and I know everybody organizes their checky differently, much like anything else that you would organize. So, let's switch angles. Uh, much like the figure video, I'm going to be watching stuff uh, right now, if you're curious. I'm trying to clean up our DVR, so I'm watching Medea's Farewell. Uh, I think that's what it is called. Farewell Medea. Yeah, Tyler Perry's Medea's Farewell Play. 
Uh, it aired on BET. It's supposed to be Tyler Perry's final performance as Medea. Uh, I guess in the stage play. I don't know if like he's gonna be reappearing in like movies or anything. But um, I one day I'm gonna write something about Tyler Perry at some point. Uh, I got a lot to say, but. Yeah, I haven't watched this yet, and it's like three hours or whatever. Uh, not that this video is going to be three hours, just so you know. So last time I did like a lot of Pentagon and Avon Chick uh, checkies, so that's like what these look like. Um, I'm still also selling and trading checky on my Facebook, so I'll put like a link below. There's other things other than those things that I'm selling. Um, I, I need to add, like, a manga and some other stuff on there, too, so if y'all are interested in purchasing or trading, uh, just let me know. Um, yeah, last time I did a lot, like I said, a lot of Pentagon and Avon Chick checkies, so I organized a lot of those, and then I had some, like, Nocturnal Bloodlust here, um, and then I had some extra ones that, um, don't really fit anywhere, um, trying to fix it and cover my name. Uh, so I had like my very first Checky from like Onicon with Sasuke, uh, and then I have Lolita 23Q and some Doubt, and then Hirito, which was in a Fake Star uh, unboxing, which I'll link to if it, it's up before I put this up, uh, and then a couple Koichi Checky that I also got from that same Fake Star like unboxing. So I might have to like shift some of these because some of the artists in here are artists I already have stuff from. Um, I try to leave room for, you know, additions in here and uh, I believe, yeah, I have another sheet of these, like, empty pages. Um, like I said in the very first video, I got these from Office Depot. They're just little baseball card, like, pages that you can get. They're a perfect fit for checkies, for checky collectors. So I'm gonna go through the first envelope. And uh, as you saw from earlier, I'm gonna start with initial L. So I have it written on here. So I'm just gonna go through all the ones that go in initial L and I bought quite a bit of them. And if there are any checky from like another date that I need to like organize, I'll put them in there as well. So yeah, uh, like these, I got, I found them elsewhere and I need to like sort these out at some point. So I'll probably sort them out while I'm configuring this. So this might be a bit of a lengthy video. I'll try to put some chapters in here to make it easier for, so you can skip around to what you're interested in. But for now, uh, I'm going to start with initial L. I'm going to look for it, the initial L and like Yon page. Because I know I have some checkies from this group already from uh, TNT. Uh, I haven't put the <laughs> any post up about my experience uh, from that year. I think that was the last year I went to... Nope, it isn't. It isn't the last time I went to Tokyo and Tulsa. I mean, it was. Yeah, it, w it wasn't from Tokyo and Tosal, sorry. It's from Katsukon. That was the very last convention I went to uh, before everything, like, shut down. So, yeah, here it is. Okay, I found it. I don't know why I'm being dumb. Okay, so my initial L stuff starts here. Because I have Yuki right here, their singer. Uh, for the most part, I try to do vocalist, guitarist, if they have another guitarist, that'd be next, uh, bassist, drummer, but sometimes I don't know their positions, so I just kind of put them wherever, and I try to have kind of like a bookend type feel, like these two are autographed, but this one isn't, um, I don't know if you can see that, let me see if I can tighten in there, so let's see, so yeah, like, I'm the glare's bad, okay, so, like, these two are autographed, but this one isn't, so I try to have, like, some sort of pattern going on. Or, like, these Otsuki Chicky here, um, let me move it up, where he's in a costume, and these two 
he's in like Tigger, and then right here he's a Hufflepuff, but he's like, this one's autographed, and it's kind of like a regular picture. I try to have some sort of pattern. Um, some sort of organization is, is the, uh, goal. <laughs> But like I said, you can organize your checky however you want. But uh, since I have all these like new like Keon and initial L checky, I'll have to like remove like uh, this. This is cause yeah, this is Kazakwe. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. I gotta remove this Kazakwe like checky right here from like Nocturnal Bloodless because I have more initial L checky to like put in with like the rest of them, and then definitely I will have to add like a new page. I guess one choice is to just like take all of these out, but that's just extra work, but we'll see as I go on and uh, I also might have to like stop and change like SD cards because I know I don't have a lot of space on this one. So let's hope for the best. Here we go, starting with initial L. Um, oh wait, before I do that, I'm going to check, I'm also going to check these. Um, I think all of these are from TNT from when I saw Ice, so I have, yeah, a bunch of, like, Ice Checky, uh, Hyuga, Aki, uh, I forgot who else was there, uh, oh, sorry, Sarshi? Yeah, Sarshi, and I feel like there was, like, one more person. Yeah, it's Hyuga, Ice, Aki, Sarshi, yeah, it was just the four of them. So, I have these from the last Tokyo and Tulsa I went to in 2019. And then I have these. I think these are from the same event. Yeah, these are from the same event. So I have a bunch of these that I need to add somewhere. And then I have this lonely hero checky from like Nocturnal Bloodless that I need to like add. So I'm gonna keep these in mind to like add where appropriate. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna split these up because, yeah, they were, like, all together, so. There you go. Even though Hugo is part of, or used to be part of Alvanchik, they're disbanded, so. Okay, now we're really gonna start. I'm sorry for all these, like, false starts. <laughs> but now I'm really gonna, like, start organizing these, so. Here we go. <laughs>
「あなたはすべて嘘をついていた」「一人暮らしの明日の家幸せな家庭広がっていた」「どうしてバランスが Jackie's away, envelopes are empty. I finished that. I took out the ones that were hanging out in the back from conventions and stuff. It's complete.、Uh, one day I gotta definitely put a picture on the binder. It kind of brings me back to my high school days. And the one on the back, I don't have pictures yet. But that is all the Jackie's from the COVID project. Uh, on top of that one hero c h e c k y that I got from somewhere, and、uh, the Tokyo and Tulsa c h e c k y s So, very happy with how it turned out so far. I'm sure、uh, me collecting c h e c k y s is a thing that's not gonna stop anytime soon. <laughs>、um, I realize I forgot to mention、um, that while trying to like sort through the ones from the COVID c h e c k y Project, I like like a lot of these bands. like I'm not really familiar with the members' names very well or their position, so I had to do a lot of Google like image searching, which is one reason why I really needed Melissa's help. So, very happy with、uh, how easy this was. I didn't have to really shift too much, which is nice. So, I'm glad now everything's in its proper place.、Um, hopefully, I like remember what is what like in the future if I decide to like get rid of them because I know there are people that like after a while they want to like get rid of some of their techie because they're not into that group anymore. But yeah, I'm very like proud of my little collection here. I know like some of my friends have massive collections, but. And then there are people out there that are just now starting their checky journey. And、uh, much like、uh, something that lovely Lore said when she was、uh, reviewing people's organization skills with their Lolita uh, uh, collection, that.、Um, 
Collections take time to build and a lot of saving, so it's not like you're going to just inherit a massive collection right off the bat. It does take a lot of time, and this took me years to collect. And people who have, like, even more checky than I do, I know that it took them years to collect what they have as well. And that just goes for anything. As you can tell from the C Clutter series, I have... I collect a lot of different things because I have a lot of different interests. So from my Japanese CDs, my K-pop CDs, movies, video games, figures, all of these things take a lot of hard work and time and your collection, whatever it may be, will eventually reach whoever you admire's like collection, whether it's a friend or a family member or just someone you follow on YouTube. One day your collection will be just as massive or whatever your goal may be, just as impressive or whatever to someone else who looks at your your collection of whatever it may be. And um, the most important thing is that you enjoy collecting whatever the thing may be and that it brings you happiness. Um, or as like Marie Kondo says, it sparks joy within you because just collecting, just to collect, just to have stuff um, can only make you happy temporarily. But if you genuinely enjoy collecting the thing, it brings you happiness like you enjoy looking at it and showing off and adding on to it and organizing and taking care and so on and so forth. Whatever the collection may be, and it doesn't have to just be nerd stuff, it can be coins, it could be stamps, it could be magazines, uh, it could just be anything that you could be collecting. As long as that brings you happiness, that's all that really matters. Um, and with that said, I hope you enjoyed me organizing my checky once again, and I want to thank Chaotic Harmony once again for providing such a fantastic project for fans to um, participate in and support their artists that they enjoy and know that they are going through a hard time during this pandemic and continue to go through a hard time. And I know it's not just Japanese artists, it's artists everywhere around the world. I know we're slowly getting back into concerts and stuff as, as we, you know, concert safely. But yeah, I want to thank them once again for providing this project and I'm looking forward to their next project with the Omnibus uh, CD as well as the other little perks that go with it. So thank you again for joining. Uh, once again, please leave in your comments below how you organize your checky if you participated in uh, Chaotic Harmony's uh, checky project. I would love to see and hear what you have gathered from them. Um, I'll leave a link in there in the description below with their site so you can check out all of the amazing artist goods that they provide as well as the Indiegogo link to their Omnibus project if it's still going on as I'm, uh, as I'm filming this or after I like upload it and stuff. Um, thank you for joining me again on another declutter slash unboxing project and I can't wait to provide some more organization videos and stuff and I hope they have been helpful and entertaining. Uh, if you like this video give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe because I know more than half of you not subscribe but yeah I'll check you out in another video. Peace guys!